Hello ladies and gentlemen, it's your host Cybergaming Studios. If you're tuning into this video and you're wondering that you want to connect your P your Android device to your PS4, but your application is saying must update application to be order to use the application. Now I have my PS4 on the top left corner of the screen and I have my Android device as right here on the screen as you can see right here. And I'm gonna show you that this actually has confirmed working. So look, pay attention to the top left corner of your screen. Hold on. And we're gonna go be going into we're going to be going into system settings as you can see here. Um, go to system settings and take go down and to all the way down to let's get down to uh, how you say uh, remote play connection settings. And you need to enable remote play, and you as well need to enable the bottom ones below. This basically connects sends a, a Wi Fi connection through PS4 directly, so you don't have to connect to internet through the through the you know internet. And you need to go to add device. It's gonna give you this this code, and you have about like about almost two minutes to instantly do this. Once after two minutes, you have to you'll be given another random code, and this is basically it. This is this is the, the Wi-Fi password that gives you randomly to connect directly to the PS4 instead of directly connecting through online anywhere you are. However, this is a big problematic issue because a lot of people do want to play online somewhere else other than just having to be at a certain um, range between their PS4 and their Android device. Now, if you don't have these files installed, um, I have a I'll have a link to the to that a specific video for you guys to check out to be able to install it. For for, for now, I have temporarily disabled um, all the comments in the previous videos for 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 the for the next update because a lot of people are, are been telling me that I have to update, that it must update app in order to use PS4 Mobile Play, and I'm going to show you that it does not. So. I'm gonna be going right now, I'm gonna be going into the PS4 Remote Play app. Make sure you also have the PS4, oops. Um, make sure you have the PS4 application installed um, and sign in with the account that you want to be able to uh, to uh, use as your primary um, account. So so say for example, we're gonna go into here and we're, we're gonna go into like, I have to change to, to change connect to, okay, no, I don't know. So right now we're 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 not signed in, but we're not worried about that. We, we, but you are have to sign in or to do this. And when you click next and it starts start searching for the PS4, click instantly the register manually. We're gonna be connecting to the PS4 directly, and this what we'll this will do is you'll send a signal to the to to your PS4 that tells it, okay, I'm not sending it to Wi-Fi. I'm sending it directly to a PS4, and that requiring to sign into PSN to be able to go to PSN and then to connect to the PS4 directly. So add the numbers, which is which is at random each time you do it. So regardless of this, this is totally different. Um, so each nut time you 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 don't do do it in a certain amount of time. Um, basically, what will happen is that it will reset and you will have to do it again. It's going to register and you notice that it says please wait and you are able to control it. However, you'll see a black screen on this recorder because the recorder does not record um, the screen, unfortunately, for this video recorder. But you are able to instantly control. Uh, as you can see, I'm controlling it with, see, my controller is right here. As you can see, here's my controller is right here. And I'm controlling my PS4 with the PS4 remote play. I see my controller. And I know you guys can't probably see anything on my screen, um, on my, digitally on my screen, but it's there and you can connect easily and instantly without having to be able to see you must update application. Now, if you want to install the files as well, install this as system app, um, I'll have a link to description to one of the videos, two videos that will allow you to do it with, it's actually three videos that will do with, with root, without root, and as we'll install it, how to do it without root as a system app, and you can do it from there. 
So that's pretty much what it is. Just remember that the number does randomize and this could only happen um, on, on the, ver the latest version, version 2.0.0 until Sony updates their application to a next um, update and then I'll have another video on how to install that. But unfortunately, but this is how basically how it's gonna, gonna get. So um, if you guys do want to see, if you guys do want to connect uh, your PS4 controller, I'll have another update on how to connect your PS4 controller to your Android device and use it as a as your primary, as and then use your your tab tablet as a screen, so you don't have to like to use the screen to use and and to be able to, and you can use your controller. I'll have another um, tutorial later up today possibly um about it but if you guys did enjoy this video i hope you guys did um let's get out of here because i'm probably so tired of seeing a last screen but i hope you guys did enjoy this it was it it was not very hard to do and i wanted to sh have show support for you guys and i wanted to see you guys what what next tutorial you guys want me to see what make what next tutorial you want to maybe make let me know in the comments and below about anything about you want me to do show you for ps4 i'll be gladly to do just let me know your suggestions in the comments below and yeah thank you guys for watching and i'll see you guys in the next video um so yeah so thank you guys for watching and if this helped you out don't forget to drop a like it shows appreciation and dedication to you to my to my fans and as well to my users so i thank you guys and i'll see you guys in the next one peace